Hello, how you doing Mike Bradley? I hope you're doing well as always. So I'm very, very excited today. Um, I've received some new pickups. Um, a quick little backstory. Let me take you, let me take you back. So regular viewers will know this guitar. If you're a new viewer, this is your first guitar. This is my Les Paul. Um, it's in lots of videos and um, I've even got a whole video dedicated just to this guitar which I'm sure is popping up right now if you want to check out after the video, after this video, sorry. So this is my Les Paul. I, I got it in November 2003. A great, great guitar. Now recently I've been playing some cool um, replica 59 Les Pauls and recently I did a video using this one, okay, which is an incredibly nice guitar, okay. And uh, actually I did a video just recently, like I said, it'll be popping up here if you want to check it out. Um, and in this guitar uh, are some Monty's pickups. And I was kind of A, B in it between, no, between this guitar to my Les Paul. And this was just trumping it. Um, it's, it's such a warmer, um, I suppose vintage kind of sound. And my one just seemed really bright and a little bit too bright and harsh, you know? Um, and I thought, I want to make the actual decision. I want to buy some new pickups. And I've only got, uh, I've only bought pickups once before really on my blue strap. I've got it on my Telecaster as well, but I was under different circumstance. But you know, I'm always a bit like, oh, is it going to change the sound too much? Would I like them? Would I not like them, etc. But after playing this, I thought if I can get even a little bit of this vibe with these pickups, I thought it's got to be done. So I got on the old blower or this day and age, email. And I emailed Matt at Monty. So hello Matt, hope you're doing well. And I've got some new pickups. And I'm really excited. I'll do a close up, but um, you know, just the little details, well the big details, what he goes into, like with the packaging, it's quite legendary now. I mean, I've opened one, this one I haven't opened yet. And you know, I'm loving the little stamp, you know, the old uh, Victorian stamps on it. Like, so I do a close up. I'm so, so excited about getting these bad boys in my, uh, in my Les Paul. Um, so here it is, oop, here it is afar. Uh, again, I'll do a close up. So very, very excited. So what I wanted to do before they go in, I wanted to do a little comparison uh, test. Just so then that way we got an idea of how it's gonna sound. So I'm gonna play my Les Paul now and uh, with the current pickups. Actually, I think I'll probably play at some point the 59 as well so you can hear what I'm talking about. Play my guitar. Sorry, I'm doing so many things here. I need, I need a tech. <laughs> I'm gonna play my guitar. I'm gonna do it reasonably well, clean with a bit of crunch, do some chords, do a bit of lead stuff, and then I will then cut next to it the new with the new pickups in. But uh, I'm not very good at a soldering iron, so a friend of mine is gonna help me out. So uh, it's I've, it's Friday at the moment. I've got to wait till Monday to see him and uh, it's gonna be a really busy week next week, but such is life, okay? So before I start playing, let's cut to three days in the future so we can see the, the pickups being put in and then we will make some sounds and hear the comparison. The joys of soldering. Silly 
And the Veneva. Yeah, but into a new era. Better era. I'm afraid to say it now. Let me dust my mind. First time I've seen inside of here. Like you can see, uh, you can see the colour fade there, can't you? Trying to take a deep breath. I'd like to geek out and see. Hello, it's this bit of paper they've left in there. Thanks, Gibson. That's been sitting there since 2003. Yeah, that's tiny, Gibson. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I look like a bit of a uh, bit of lacquer. Or a bit of paint or something. It was covering something there, wasn't it? Oh yeah, it does look like a bit of that. Talking to myself again, I'm bored of all Out with the old, and in with the new. Me for you to come my way, but in the meantime, I will act my way. Will the devil walk away? Will he leave my side? A rain cloud offers over me in the sunshine. I'm searching for a reason why you're not in my life. Clean and shiny. <laughs> and the complications that seem to come my way. Here's my soul, lay bare for you. Every time I walk this beat, I feel so down and blue. So again, I feel the devil's on my side. Monty's are in. Shame.
Should say as well that these are the exact same strings what has been on the guitar when the original pickups were on as well. I wanted to make sure they're the exact string because you know newer strings have a slightly more brighter sound to it, brighter tone. So the exact same strings, they're um, Ernie Ball, uh, the really expensive ones, para, para Diems, I think they're called, 11 to 50 I think it is. So yeah, exact same strings and uh, <laughs> I've got to keep restringing it, retuning it because um, they're a bit bit knackered now these strings but uh but yeah exact same strings hopefully you're hearing the difference <laughs> 